I just had a pack of four chicken breasts and I just butterflied them. Anyways, cut them through the middle. So I'm doing three in this pan that are going to be seasoned and have barbecue sauce. And one, two, five in this pan that are going to be seasoned and have pesto and cheese. And then I'm going to cook pasta on the side for these and rice on the side for these. My kids probably won't eat the pesto ones, so I'm doing barbecue for them. Um, and my babies may eat pesto, so I'm doing five. So me and my husband have one for dinner, one for lunch, and then one for the kids if they want one. If not, then the babies will split one and the big boys will each have one. So I'm just going to do salt, pepper, onion powder, and garlic powder on all of them. And then, like I said, barbecue and pesto and cheese. So let me season. And remember, season both sides of your meat. Okay. So now all sides of my meat are seasoned. I'm just going to throw a little, uh, all, uh, little, little uh, what is this? Avocado oil on the chicken and then go from there. Okay, the barbecue chicken is done. It is going to go into a 350 degree oven, 20, 25 minutes because... The chicken breasts are a lot thinner than normal, so they'll cook quicker. Probably 25 minutes, maybe 30. So I'm going to go ahead and get those in. Okay, so I didn't use all of this pesto. So this is the pasta my husband and I are having. I might throw the pesto on here um, and dice up some tomatoes. I cooked a little bit of pesto down with some vegetable stock to thin it out a bit and uh, some diced tomatoes and throw it on top of this with the chicken. And there's the chicken. So again, 25 minutes in the oven. And I've just topped it with some mozzarella and Parmesan cheese. It already smells really good. So I can't wait to have dinner. Okay, so I'm just boiling some water for my pasta. I've got my rice going back here. It's just basmati rice with uh, coconut oil. So yeah, simple plain white rice for the kids. And then I made enough so that I would have leftovers for whatever chicken they don't finish tonight. They can have for lunch tomorrow. I don't know if me and my husband will have leftover pasta, but if we do, it'll probably go with him for lunch and then I'll just have my chicken on a plate. Maybe I'll chop it up and throw it over some lettuce. I don't know. But yeah, dinner is quick, simple, and easy tonight. Okay, so I just diced up two little Roma tomatoes. Mixed them with some pesto and some garlic and threw that on the pasta. Meat is done, so I'm going to plate up dinner. So here is my plate. It smells amazing. I took a little bite of my husband's chicken. It tastes amazing. Yep, that's your dinner. Barbecue chicken and rice. Really, Jarvis? <laughs> here, take your bowl. There you go. pasta delicious, Bo? Bash it doodle. You like that pasta? Good, I'm gonna save some for lunch tomorrow for you. Yum, yum, yum. I'm so proud of you. Yum. <laughs> You're a mess. I love Don't forget you. to check my description box for all my links.